Good day. I'm Mike Conway with the Arizona Geological Survey, talking today about the outsized impact of Arizona Geological Survey geologic products and services on Arizona's economy. Let me start by noting that AZGS receives $941,000 from the state of Arizona annually. In 2019, we leveraged those funds to bring in $1.36 million in external funds. Our stakeholders in government and industry used our geologic products and services to avoid costs on the order of $30 million. The state of Arizona thus saw a 34-fold return on their investment for a one-year period. In 2016, the survey faced an existential, an existential crisis as we moved from state agency status to the University of Arizona, where our state funding was revoked. Fortunately, the following year, our state funding of $941,000 was returned. But this near extinction experience inspired us to canvas our stakeholders in government, mining, exploration, emergency management, and hydrology regarding the value of our geologic products and services to their work efforts. So we worked with the Eller School of Management and leveraged economic assessment tools developed by the State Geological Surveys of Kentucky, Ohio, and Indiana to develop a survey strategy to assess the benefits based on the cost of replacement and by proportion of project costs, which allowed us to estimate the economic contribution of AZGS products and services to the Arizona economy. Our geo products and services are provided as public goods to the people and industries of Arizona through our document repository, includes all of our maps and reports published between 1915 and 2020, and our mining data site, which comprises 400,000 document pages of unpublished geologic maps, mineral reports, assays, correspondence, and photographic images. The survey was tailored specifically to evaluate the socioeconomic benefits in four areas, economic natural resources development, public safety and resilience, effective public administration, and the increased competitiveness of small to moderate sized geotechnical firms. The online survey was conducted in spring 2019, included 31 questions, and was distributed to about 700 Arizona geoscientists. 176 individuals submitted completed reports. We coupled the survey responses with web analytics of AZGS geologic products, and hour-long telephone interviews with 14 stakeholders. The two graphs below illustrate participants overwhelmingly acknowledge that our geologic products were essential to their organizations and to project success. When asked about the essentialness of select AZGS products to fulfilling their organization's mission, the majority of respondents selected often are always essential. On the right hand side is an example of one of our digital geologic maps for Twin Buttes in Pima County, Arizona. In evaluating cost avoidance to Arizona's geotech and geosciences community, the Eller team followed methodology of the Indiana Geological Survey and combined the results of the 31 question survey with web analytics of AZGS map products and reports to estimate the cost avoidance of stakeholders due to the availability of those products. From our responses, direct responses to the survey, we gleaned that Arizona Geo products were on the order of $77.7 .7 million for that one year period. Five to $7 million was saved using, directly using AZGS products and services, and $2 million was required to purchase, AZ, to purchase the AZGS Geo products and services if otherwise unavailable. The value of product categories, for example, digital geologic maps, was conservatively calculated by taking one half the page views for a particular project, times the bounce rate, times the weighted average cost to estimate the cost avoidance figure. The breakout of the cost avoidance valuation is shown on the graph to the right. Mining, the total is about $30 million. Mining data came in at the largest value at 20.8 million, and our interactive maps online and our geohazard maps online, plus our digital maps, came in about $7.7 .7 million, with our reports and geoeducational materials coming in at $1.8 million total. 
We asked a number of open-ended questions and we got hundreds of responses from the participants of the, from our stakeholders who, who participated in the, in the survey. Here are four examples. I'll just point out the one on the upper left-hand side from an employee, former employee of the Bureau of Land Management. And he had to say, AZGS has helped identify aggregate resources on public lands, allows BLM to properly manage those lands and adds up to hundreds of thousands of dollars each year going into the public till. AZGS Geologic Products help fuel Arizona's economy. They make small and medium-sized geotechnical firms competitive. They support natural resources development, improve public safety, and make public administration more efficient. The outsized impact of AZGS on the state economy yields a cost-benefit ratio of approximately 34 to 1. State geological surveys are a wise and fruitful investment in the U.S. We want to thank the Eller School of Management intern program for supporting this work and the geologic surveys in Ohio, Indiana, and Kentucky for conducting earlier studies that led the way on this. You can always reach me at fmconway at arizona.edu if you have questions, and you will find the entire report, the Arizona Geological Survey Economic Impact Report, at our document repository repository.azgs.az.gov. It's uh, free for download. Thank you very much.